It's been truth to power. Yeah. Hi, my name is Tess Lira, and I'm the 2019 Speak Up Sing Out Songwriting Contest winner. I think in our society that age can be a really big barrier and because of your age people can underestimate you. And so me writing this song was basically saying that even though I'm 14, I still have a voice and my voice should still be heard. My song is basically about angst and you know I see a lot of social injustice around me a lot of the time and especially being a teenager there's a lot of anxiety that comes with school and friend groups and all that and everybody thinks that's the biggest issues going on. And sometimes I have to take a step back and say, well, this isn't even the biggest issue. There's so many other things to be upset about. And when I started to acknowledge all the other things going on in life, then I really felt that I had more of a touch with what to write about. And I wrote it just to get all of my feelings out into paper and, you know, about how I could stand up for myself and inspire other people to stand up for themselves versus just letting it slide and ignoring it and thinking, since it doesn't affect me, that I shouldn't relate to it. I think music is a very natural thing and everybody can relate to it. So having something that universal that doesn't really have to be taught to you, it's just something since birth basically you listen to music, it's, it's very calming, it can be fun, it can ha give you all these types of emotions and moods. It's really important that when you listen to a song, everybody takes something different from it. So music in general, one person can hear it and say, wow, you know, I was having my personal issue, but now, you know, there's so many more things to be upset about. And somebody else can look at it and think of something that they could do to help the world. And overall, it's so inspiring because you don't have to know something or know a language or know anything to understand it. You just need to feel it in your body, and that can do so much for different people. Sometimes I come home from school, and I've had a rough day, and I just sit, and I think, how can I reflect on my day? And um, by reflecting on my day, I start to just pour words out into paper and really just let all my emotions out, which is very therapeutic for me, actually. Um, and then I put music to it, and I try to think of how the words of what I'm trying to get across can meet with the music and the melody to create a mood that can really connect to people's emotions. Um, and then I just start singing it, and that's when the magic starts to happen. I start to add little riffs and little things that just make me feel so connected to my own music. If somebody came to me and said that they didn't feel they could write a song, I would say start with a poem. Because all good songs start from the words. So if you write a poem and that really connects to you, then, you know, pick up the music and connect it as it goes. But the most important part of songwriting is just getting out what you need to say. And a poem can do that as well. For people entering the songwriting contests, I would say, don't enter because you want to win. Enter because if you were to win, you think your song could really make a difference and could really affect society or you know, could cause some good in the world. So make sure you want to win for the right reasons. The phrase, speak truth to power, to me, means your voice, people will listen to. Although it might not be the whole world, there's definitely someone out there that will relate to what you say. And speaking and standing up and getting your voice heard can really change your community, your society, more than you could ever think of.